boy hey dude welcome back um yeah i'm not i'm not i'm not gonna do a fucking voice uh how, how you guys doing today it's been uh it's been a couple of days um i enjoyed my break relaxed a bit okay sorry i was looking at a text yeah um Honestly, I was considering streaming last night and stuff, and then I was like, I got home really fucking late, so I was just like, nah, I'm not really feeling like doing a late night stream. I might do one today, who knows? Because there's a couple games I want to do tonight. <laughs> Maybe a brand new one, which is, uh, we'll talk about it when we get to it a little later. Check out the reservoir. So, off camera, I did do this. Um... I did work on the crimes and stuff, and I stopped a whole bunch of crimes. So now we don't have to really worry about it that much. Attention what the and fuck? This is Sorry, I got like an ad for Archer. <laughs> I didn't even realize Archer, uh, Archer was still a fucking thing. I thought that show got cancelled. Yeah, we still have one more crime to- well, two more crimes to take care of. I wanted to complete it on camera, because why not? Yeah, the only city- Ironically, the only area still dangerous is Hell's Kitchen. <laughs> so for like the longest time when I can- this is a- this is a very um... This is something I genuinely believed when I was a little kid. Cause I learned about Hell's Kitchen from Daredevil, of course. I don't know why when I was younger I used to think Hell Ki Hell's Kitchen was an entire city and it would- I didn't think it was a district in New York, I thought it was like its own city like Gotham or- or New York City. But no, it's a, it's a, it's just a district. Or a borough, I don't know. I don't know the uh, how you would how would you classify certain districts in New York and stuff. It's like LA too, where it's like you can't tell which one's a city, which one's a town and stuff. And like some cities some towns are considered cities and some towns are con some cities are considered town. It's really fucking weird in LA. There's probably somebody who knows how to how, how to explain this properly, and that's good. Because, honestly, I don't know how to explain shit. When it comes to this type of stuff. Oh yeah, I forgot. What the fuck did that guy say? All I do is Spider-Man, you, you, Spider-Man is causing problems for all of us. What are we gonna do, Spider-Man here? I'm gonna remember all the attack, the attack patterns and stuff. So I think, um, I think we only need one more level to, for us to go up and stuff because we're almost done with the, the main story, I should say. We're not actually done with the game itself. We still have, I actually am gonna be doing all the DLCs, so I do promise you that, folks. It's like, it's like my Fallout streams, if you guys remember, if uh, we have any old, like, veterans of the channel and stuff who remember I did all of those. I don't know how the fuck I did that in one, st in one stream too, or it was... I think the, the one I questioned the most was, like, uh, Dead Money. Gotta find a way to get stable out of New York. That, uh, that one where you have to, that heist. It's not that long, it's just that it's like, it's it's padded out because you have like sections where you can't go without a fucking bomb. That's it's it's straight up just a suicide squad. It's like, you're, you're like a shitty suicide squad. The only reason why I call it that, because you have a bomb implanted in your neck. Well, more of a bomb strapped to your neck. Yeah, no, D New Vegas is very interesting when it comes to, when it comes to, uh villains and stuff i actually did kind of like that concept where like it's a it's an underground bunker in the middle of the sierra desert and anyone who enters the anyone who enters the bunker gets like sprayed with knockout gas and has a bomb strapped to their neck i did like that idea and stuff and like how instead of it's like they say it's it's haunted by the the casino is haunted by ghosts but the ghosts are like holograms and stuff and i that sound like a- what is going on with this? Is this guy in the build? Uh, game, I can- Uh... Huh. Uh... I don't think I can deal with this guy. Oh! Okay, never mind, I can. Oh, uh, spider logo. 
Nah, we get to. Can you shoot me? Uh, can I shoot? Can I shoot through the wall? I'm so confused on what I can and can't do here. Okay, he's out. All right, cool, cool. Uh, okay. So we taking care of all the crimes. Nice. That was super weird, but you know what? I'll take it over nothing. So anyways, as I was saying, um, it, it, I thought it was pretty interesting and stuff for, with the whole hologram ghost thing. I never played Bioshock, but I feel like that's kind of how it would kind of feel like. This, like, relic of a distant, like, era and stuff, but you only have the ma machines of that era that are keeping it alive and stuff. I could be completely wrong about Bioshock, I don't really fucking care. I'm gonna play it though, so I, I do look forward to playing that. I was thinking of starting some of the games, uh, speaking of like games I'm playing, I was thinking of starting some games I said it was gonna be doing in, in August a little or in sorry not August, uh, September a little early. But that would mean I have to focus on a couple of games and stuff. Originally, this, I wasn't going to be doing Spider-Man today, but I was thinking like, man, I'm like already almost done with the story, might as well finish it. I, I'll i probably take like a week break from Spider-Man and stuff, and then we'll start doing, we'll start like just barreling through the DLCs and stuff. I don't know if I'm 100% each of the DLCs, but I'll play them out. Like, I'll, get, I'll, I'll do a good playthrough of them and stuff. I think the main one I'm really excited for is Miles Morales, because I, I only played like the first section of the game, I never really beat it, so that's going to be really kind of fun to play. Always been a bit, always been a big fan of the character and stuff, so. The reservoir. No sign of Scorpion. Okay, yeah, let's, let's, go, let's go fight Scorpion at this abandoned haunted house, sweet. Now if I was I'm sure nothing will go wrong like here. A scorpion, where would I be? Uh, behind me. Yeah. Ah, it's good to see my favorite poisonous killer. I'd end it now, but Octavius is paying, and he wants to torture you, which I respect. I don't know why. I was getting like Willem Dafoe vibes, where he was talking about like torturing, or it's just like I want to have fun with their nice and slow. Yeah, not a very good. Well, I'm default impression, but poison? it's alright. Can't be. This can't be real. Oh yeah. <laughs> Must be the poison. But I can't take any. I thought this was actually really cool. The, the whole rising, the whole uh, hallucination scene and stuff. But it's pretty. It's kind of like scarecrow. It's kind of like scarecrow's fear toxin segments in Arkham Arkham Asylum and stuff. It's always cool when it's always cool when games that are set in like realistic air like semi realistic, I should say worlds and stuff and then they okay. just go fucking <laughs> off the walls with shit like this neurotoxin so i can create an antidote i always thought that was really cool and stuff scorpions made some upgrades yes we we have to stop it by matching patterns that dastardly fool he's nothing but a madman now if only i had a basic understanding of patterns one. Take this one. There we go. And okay, so then I put you here. Yes. Remove it. That's good. There we go. Sweep. Hallucinogenic neurotoxin. My brain will create Thank God. That my body Thank God all the criminals in New York have a basic understanding of patterns. <laughs> they, they all use leaps. They all use jump start as their, as their basis of coding. <laughs> I have to create the antidote fast. I have to natural steroid. Extract from I just like to think of um, do the trick. just shield or something. Nearby. Using it's fucking jumpstart. Is it jumpstart or leap? Wait. No, jumpstart, yeah. Jumpstart. Or leapfrog. <laughs> as their as their basis for like their series of like supercomputers and shit. <laughs> if you can't tell, I'm not I'm not very 
uh, knowledgeable when it comes to coding, but you know what? I, I'm still gonna make my jokes because it's fun for me. Tony Stark, Tony Stark's. The only reason why his is more advanced is because he uses Window 90. He uses Window Vi Windows Vista. <laughs> I mean, that is probably a jump. It can be both. Oh god, am I gonna have a Far Cry 3 trip? Or fucking... Oh my god, you know what? Since actually Michael Mondo is playing the Scorpion and stuff, he also plays Voss in Far Cry 3, we can have... We can have Scorpion going, You are me, and I am you. But I'm Mondo. Way up in the high, way up in the sky. You thought you had your finger on the pussy trigger. But down here, Doc, you hit the ground. That thing is crazy. <laughs> Just Scorpion starts going, Did I ever tell you the definition of insanity? Insanity. Doing the same fucking thing over and over and over again. Thinking shit will change. But I'm on I like that. I like that spider symbol. Where'd you get that? My sister gave it to you? She's gonna make a warrior out of you. <laughs> I never I never got to play that um that DLC that they did for Far Cry 6 and stuff. I only seen videos, I'm just, I might I might play it just so I, I might play Far Cry 6 just for that part. I don't know. After Far Cry 5, after like Far Cry 4, I kind of just like. I was okay with Far Cry and stuff. I will admit, what introduced me to the series was Far Cry 3, but it's like. Actually, no, Far Cry 4. I did really like I liked Far Cry 4 and 5. I think it was New Dawn where I was just like, alright. I did, I did like it, but I don't know. When I saw Six, I was like, yeah, I might play it, and I never did. So who knows? Maybe in the future I might pick it up. It's pretty cheap right now, on, I think on Steam, so I might, I might download it or so buy it and download it. We'll see. Or maybe play for. I think three is really cheap right now. I, I was thinking about about either streaming three. Oh, okay, oh yeah, I forgot about the scorpion tails. I was thinking about playing three, uh, either three or uh, uh, blood dragon. I'm on more. I'm in your head. <laughs> Hey Spider-Man, you wouldn't know a Jason Brody at all. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Real or no, when I cure this poison, I'm coming for you, Mac. Hey Spider-Man, you ever seen better call Saul? I play a guy named Nacho. <laughs> this is a terrible fucking boss Montenegro <laughs> impression. This is a terrible one. <laughs> Again. Hmm. Insanity. Interesting. I mean, technically, We're yeah. Too late. Technically, we can consider us the definition of insanity. This isn't you, it works. Yeah. Oh, but it is me. The me polite society values. The parts of myself I suppress. And you help me. Oh, fuck. Yeah, just. So Spider-Man then cannot. When Spider-Man dives off, it's like a. You're too late. It's like that baby Just demon from uh, me. from uh, was it Resident Evil when you get eaten by the baby demon? That is a weird sentence. I just, that is a weird thing I just said. Baby demon. <laughs> if you've never if you've never played Resident Evil Eight, there's a. Spoilers, but there's a part where you start tripping balls in a basement and you see a you see a fetus demon crawl out of the basement and you have to you don't fight it but you have to run away from it and 
You bring nothing it's. I think it's canon where if it eats you, it's no. you. Stop. It's a halluc. It's of course it's a hallucination, you. but apparently you die of a heart attack or something. Please, just talk to me. Go, fuck. Ah, too busy talking about too busy talking about fetus demons. <laughs> This is a weird fucking. <laughs> this is a weird. This is a weird conversation I'm having with myself. To think I called you a friend. Fetus demons. I am your friend, Fetus to me. Oh no, I'm just thinking of stupid Harry Potter spells. <laughs> Harry, I'm pregnant. Fetus delitus. Now I just need to mix up the antidote. Looks like I'm headed back to the lab. I'm nearly cured. Sorry to bust up your plans. It's only, it's only oh, almost eight o'clock at night, and I'm already having three a.m. brain. But you know what? That's cool. Count on. I like these little rambling psychic fucking. Hell. I actually unplugged my headphones, so give me a sec real quick. Oh yes, record in a dark room, that's a good idea. Don't worry, I'm not quitting the i I'm not rage quitting, I'm just trying to follow Where the fuck are my headphones went? This better not fuck with the audio, I swear. <laughs> Alright, let's hear. You know, I was considering getting like one of those like light up headphones and stuff, and I was like, how much do you think? I feel like those are probably expensive. What do you think they would go for? Because I, I feel like it would be like 200 or something. Can I hear anything, by the way? Okay, I can hear shit. I'm not deaf. Yay. Uh, I don't know. Because a lot of the equipment I use nowadays is pretty cheap, so. Who's to say, like, any expensive equipment now is, like, probably, like, cheaper now? I guess because maybe it's, like, closer to the holidays and stuff, that's probably why. But, I mean, it's August. The holidays are not for, like, another, like, three months, so. You think he's actually in the? You think he's actually in the laboratory? You think he's actually in the lab, or is he just tripping balls at a McDonald in a McDonald's restroom? <laughs> I can I can see that I can see that um, Daily Bugle <laughs> headline: Spider Man tripping balls in the McDonald's. I, I legit forgot about you, Michael. Ma I, I was about to call Michael Mando. You don't forget about Michael Mando. Nobody does. He's a legendary actor. Greatest actor of our generation. Yeah, I only know like three roles of, of his work. You got Nacho Varga. You got Vos Montenegro. Uh, I for Scorpion. Now I know you're the you know, I haven't. By the way, I have not seen season six, but yes, I do know about what happens to Nacho. Oh, cool, we get specials and stuff. Nice. You like doing that. Give me more to battle focus. Is it gonna be. Okay, it's the same one. Eh, it's fine. Uh, bring it, Scorpion. Let's go. Just keep, yeah, just keep dodging. The world be better off without you. I mean, it's working. Yeah, gets the job done. So, how do you guys feel about the design of Scorpion in this game? I kind of, I like, I like the whole like robotic suit and stuff. It does kind of make it look like he's kind of a mutant and stuff with the whole like, fucking. Two finger, two well actually three fingers and two. F I, no, I think that's just his, that's just a suit. 
I, I like it. I think my favorite one will still... My favorite design of Scorpion will still always be that, um... Uh, I hope people have played it. You guys know, uh, Shattered Dimensions, that one where you gotta go through, t you gotta go through different dimensions as different Spider-Man to stop Mysterio. There's, a uh, in, when you get to play as, uh, Miguel O'Hara, the Spider-Man 2099, his has, like, different versions as, of the, uh, of the rogues gallery and stuff, and one of them is Scorpion, and he's like this giant mutant scorpion and stuff running around a future. Why am I in my underwear? I think I took decontamination a little too far. <laughs> I'd better put some clothes on. Much better. Spider Man has spider Let's underwear. Just go ahead and forget that ever happened. Who gave him spider underwear? What do you think? Probably, you probably bought it at Target or something. Can you? That's like thinking like Batman underwear. Actually, um, well, I mean, they got superhero underwear of everything. Come on, let's be honest. Let's see what let's see what plans Otto was so working on. Memories of working here, all tainted now. Huh. I kind of like some of these designs. Yeah, they look pretty cool. Dude, that's hey. You know, if he put like two lines at the top and the bottom of that green one right here. The one by the destroy it would just look like the Green Lantern bucket logo. Yo, yo, yo ass gonna get sued by Oa. The idea is fucking the Green Lantern core is so fucking strange, but like the entire Lantern core, I should say, is very strange. But in particular, I really like the green. The green. What the fuck? Oh, okay. Cool. Glad to know that Otto's been making weapons for the Patriots. The... Not not the football team. The group from... The group from, uh, Metal Gear. I like to think of it. It's the actual Patriot. The fucking New England Patriot. It's... <laughs> this whole time it's been the, the villains of... Of the Metal Gear games. It's the fucking New England Patriots. <laughs> Somebody lit- that's not- I will admit, that's not my joke. Somebody in my chat, when I was playing Metal Gear 2, made that joke and it was really fucking funny. <laughs> they were- they were saying they were like working on a mod or something and it was uh, they wanted to put like a, a New England Patriots jersey on <laughs> Metal Gear Ray. <laughs> Some people are just very creative. And I really hope that guy, if that guy's still working on that project, I really hope. He, like, shows it off one day, because I, I want to see that. Because it, it, it just sounds so fucking stupid, but really funny. I really I really love stupid mods, honestly. I think my my love for, like, really dumb mods, like, was was sparked from, like, stuff like Skyrim and stuff. I feel like a lot of people learned about mods through Skyrim. Of course, it, mods have been around since, like, the beginning of coding and stuff. But, like, I feel like my fascination came from, like, uh, watching, like, MXR videos, or... Who the fuck was it? Who? I'm trying to remember. It was, like, another guy who did, like, mod showcases and stuff. I guess Minecraft, too, was another another venue that, uh, of how I learned about mods and shit, because you gotta put all a whole bunch of random shit in that game. I legit thought... I was a very dumb kid when I first saw this. Uh, there was a um, there was a Godzilla mod, and I legit thought, oh, you could summon Godzilla in the game, and he could he, you could fight him and stuff. You could fight him just like how my my fucking bit rate is going insa insane right now. I don't know if you can hear this during the recording later, but we'll, we'll see. I'm just gonna be swinging around for a bit. Yep, there it is, the crash. Give me a sec. Take a moment. You're watching the storm during the recording later. We just had a quick crash right now. Don't worry, I'm fixing it as we speak.
If anything, I'll probably just switch. I'll probably do, I have like two. I'm gonna switch my other Wi Fi. It's fine. That would just mean I have to disconnect everything and then the reconnect. It's no worries. Looks like we lost a couple people along the way, but you know what? That's completely fine. It happens. Great. Oh shit. <laughs> the fucking stream just stopped. That legit happened. What? No way. I'm gonna stop the stream real quick. Don't worry, I'm just I'm gonna record for a moment. Nah, fuck actually. Give me a quick moment, folks. Uh, I apologize about this. So just let me do a quick uh, check on some things and go check on my Wi Fi router, see if anything get fucking messed with. Um, If you left because of the recording or the issue, real quick, I apologize. Don't worry. You're more than welcome to watch the recording later today on uh, YouTube. Yeah, that was, that was weird. Okay, so just give me one quick moment. I'm gonna go check my see if everything's okay. Cause this has been happening recently, like way too much, especially last time before I took the break. Give me a moment, folks. I'll be back in a sec. Okay, um, so I was worried, I was doing a little bit of messing around with the router to see if, if I can try to fix it or something. I'm questioning at this point, I might get an extender or something like a Ethernet cable and just plug it into the PC. It's like these crashes, man, have been like way too frequent stuff. So I'm just like, 
I don't, th I don't think Ethernet cables are that expensive, so. I'd probably just wait till the next paycheck or something. Pay for it. I'm hoping it's not an internet issue, but I feel and maybe it might be. Yeah. This is, and I'm just basing this off of ifs and stuff, but I'm hoping it's just like an encoder issue or something. Maybe I need to update the. Enc I know you guys. I know you guys probably hate to hear me talk about the encoder way too much. So I'm gonna probably if it. I'm just gonna say this now. If it crashes again, we'll take a quick break. I won't stop the stream, no. Uh, I'll just... Okay. Well, I won't end the stream, I should say. I haven't seen anime face to face since the fire. I'll, um, Think I can afford take, like, a couple minutes to try to fix it, see if I can try to come up with a solution, or figure out a solution. I'm... Uh, to anybody who's familiar with OBS and stuff, I if you guys know any information when it comes to encoders and stuff, you're more than welcome to share your input. I would really appreciate it or anything. I'm still learning this stuff, so I'm like a little bit of a newbie when it comes to recording and stuff, so. Yeah. Maybe maybe I might need to just like lower the maybe I might need to like lower the um, resolution or something. Maybe it's that. But, who knows. If... I'm gonna test it next, next stream just to see if that helps. Like, lowering... Because right now I'm at, I'm at 1080p, but I'm going to move to 720 just for a bit. Just to see if that helps. I'm sure it won't be too noticeable. Like, cause I know I know iPhones usually, well, phones in general usually use, like, what is it, 720? And it looks fine on there, so it shouldn't be. For mobile, probably if you're, like, probably for, like, PC users, probably. It might be a little noticeable, but I, I feel like on phone you wouldn't really know. Like if you watch the streams on your phone or something, it wouldn't be noticeable. Right over here. But enough tech talk. Let's back, get back the to the game. Can do is keep everyone fed. Oh, Peter, it is so good to see you. Peter, I'm dying of a deadly disease. Don't worry about it though. Good, but busy. Oh, let me go. <laughs> see, I told you. I got the goblin AIDS. I got the gates. I'm okay. <laughs> Didn't you tell me something once about accepting that I'm human just like everyone else? You and them. <coughs> Masters at turning my own words against me. I am fine, Peter. Yo, Grant, your uncle just... was very good at gaslighting me. Where's Miles? Did he help out? No, so he fucked is. <laughs> He's off picking up medical supplies from the relief. He was center. also good at catching bullets, Amazing. especially in his chest cavities. <laughs> Okay. It wasn't Let's a robber it. that killed Uncle Ben. It was Ant Man. Unloading and checking with Miles. Deal. Deal. It's like how in it's like how with the Wayne, the Wayne's like murders and stuff. They'll be like, oh, the Br Bruce Bruce's parents didn't die from just a random mugger. No, they were part of this underground society and stuff. You, you and me. How did you, Miles? How did you end up going to get milk for your mom to, in the middle of a fucking gang, in the middle of a fucking crim convict underground? How did you get here? It's like, okay, mom, I'm off to go get some eggs. I'm also gonna infiltrate several gang locations. Gotta, gotta get that spider training somehow. The only way for you to become a spider in this game is you must infiltrate gang activity. <laughs> that wall. <clears throat> Medical containers in that tent. Maybe this will be easy. Oh, mighty convenient that we're in an Oscorp yeah. camp. Be very, very... It'd be very, very bad if we ran across a spider in here. That especially has weird glitchy powers. Just hack the car. Oh, sorry, the droid. Drone. Droid. Drone. Same thing. 
I feel like my 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 <laughs> I almost called him Mike. <laughs> Mike Morales. More supplies over there. Need to get past. Yeah, hack, hack the generator. Use your new use your nonsensical hacking skills, smiles. <laughs> Everything is operated by Apple nowadays. I mean, probably in the future. Yeah, who knows? Let's hear a little bit of exposition from the other criminals. to get racist we didn't need to get racist here okay it's not cool he's like i get it man we're criminals but we're not monsters jeez what's wrong with you today to eric i don't know it's it's that video game it's that video game trope of making making us seem like we're terrible people but in real life we're just victims here <laughs> victims of circumstance <laughs> Yeah, Eric, how did you become a victim of circumstances? By robbing a bank. The supply tent. Crossing fingers. A couple trauma kids. I'm a victim. No you, you, gotta, you gotta see, dude. Gotta I'm a victim here. He goes, how are you a victim? You blew up a bridge. <laughs> and you told Spider-Man to go fuck himself. Gotta avoid that sniper. Can I hack the sniper? Can I, can I hack the sniper so the bullet goes backwards? That can... You know what? Probably that's gonna be a thing in Watch... If, if they ever make Watch Dogs 4. I feel like that might be a thing. Yeah, just, just go in front of the sniper laser. That's not a bad idea. Nothing will go bad in me going in front of the sniper laser. Oh, hey, how you doing? <laughs> just cuts to the sniper's point of view, just Miles drops. <laughs> just like, oh, God. I just wanted to go get some milk, not get a fucking sniper, get fucking shot in the head. Brutal, man. God damn it, this, this guy has peripheral vision. I hate it when people have peripheral vision. It sucks. Who are you, human? Gotta avoid that sniper. Here, have you go over here. Yeah. Whoa! Jesus Christ, this guy has fucking ears. Alright. I see, I see what I gotta do. Bam. Gotta avoid that sniper. Bam. Look, look, look at the drone, it's making noise. Ooh. Whoa, pretty crazy, man. Where'd that drone go? Oh, shit, where'd it go? Ah, that's not good. Uh. Hopefully this time he doesn't have peripheral vision. Probably might. I don't know. No! Looks like his peripheral vision failed him this time. Good. Love it when it happened. Especially in video games. Alright. What am I throwing? A stick? Or whatever the fuck this is? What is this? Oh, come on, Crate. Be the one. Oh, hey, look, it. hey, look, it's goblin juice. Moxicillin. Perfect. Oh, okay. He's a damn did, wait, did Rhino just throw a dead body? Oh, okay, okay, no, they're sable guards. Found the exploding bulldozer. Supplies, 
Gentlemen, I apologize. My associate is inelegant. Yes, trust the man dressed up like a scorpion. He's pretty calm. You could totally trust the guy dressed up like a big bug that just stabbed your best friend. What kind of cosplay shit was that? They definitely won't hear me with the pills rattling around in my. Oh, okay, oh no! Oh god, god damn it! No. Quick, I need to make more noise so they won't detect me. Oh. <laughs> he ran like two feet, and he was like, "All right, I'm done." Maybe I can sneak beneath him. We are having fun with life now. I will have fun with your pain. Come out. I'm underage. I'm underage. You can't. You can't say that, man. I can hear you, though. Would you keep chanting? Please don't. Oh. 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 That, that, that wasn't good. Oh no. Yes. That's a lie. Little Miles Morales, I can hear you in the grate. Who do you think you are? The big boss? Where are you, little teenage boy? I'm going to beat you. I'm going to... I'm going to use my horn. I can't think of anything good. I can't think of any puns or anything to use with the horn. But it's okay. I'm not the I'm not the intellect type. I am the Rhino. Do not expect me to talk like Bane. Little man, I can hear you monologuing to yourself. I do not like monologues. It me it less action. Would you like to know my favorite Rolf character? I love the rhinoceros. It made no sense that he showed up at the end at the end of James and the Giant Peach. But you know what? I like having the representation. It's pretty cool. We need to get more rhinoceroses in the movies. Why was the rhino in the sky? I don't know. I was just happy to see a rhino. <gasps> Why did the why did the old lady kept threatening the little boy with the rhinoceroses? I don't know. Those people were weird. They had this weird obsession with killing a spider. And they thought using axes as punishment. Why why would you use axe as punishment on little boy? That's not okay. By the way, that actually happened in James and the Giant Peach. I don't know if people have actually seen that movie. I seen I, I like watched it recently, and I forgot. I, when I was a kid, I legit thought that was like a live action. It is a live action movie, but most of it, it's like in. I forget the name of the um, of the of the studio who did the uh, the motion the claymation and stuff. It's the same. I think it's the same guys who did um. Think I'll try another way. Who did Nightmare Before Christmas and stuff? I don't like Nightmare Before Christmas. There was no rhinos. I only watch movie if it has rhino in it. Come here, let me give you big hug. With horn. I use my horn to hug people. <laughs> no, that is not an innuendo. Don't be disgusting, you are nasty. I am just rhino who likes to impale people. That's my exit. That's all. Don't make it weird. This isn't even a good Russian accent. It keeps turning into weird Swedish every two seconds. 
Hey, Miles, who's your favorite rhinoceros? Is it me? I hope it's me. There's not many. Do you hate that I was not in the Marvel movies? I showed up for like two seconds. You didn't see me. I bet you didn't see me. I know it. I was in the sky. Like my hero, the rhinoceros. We're both. See? I am like him. I am like my hero from James and Giant Peach. Why was the boy in Peach? I don't know. I was just happy to see it. Very cool movie. It's the only movie that I, I got to see in my prison cell. I watch it religiously. I didn't even know there were other movies. That, that sounds oddly depressing. The only movie you get to watch is a fucking children's movie. Hello, Miles. It's good to see you. Goodbye. Miles, you know I can hear you, right? You're like 10 feet away from me. I can hear you going, go, go, go. Stop being a mo If you're going to do an inner monologue, do it in your head. Whose head, man? Like me, the rhino. I did not like Goose Game. It was not. It was hard. I could not solve puzzles. I had to honk at people. What kind of rhino honks at people? Very disrespectful. You should let me know I have these. Yes, you should let me. Get off me. Oh God, Star! Get it's Star Lord. He's back. Help. Oh shit. Oh no. Oh god, he got the other Guardians of the Galaxy with him. He got Yondu with him. You can't just push people around like that. Or what? He's gonna use he's gonna use his he's gonna use his needle. Start he's, he starts whistling and he lets you see a fucking needle come out of nowhere. I just hear him goes. Okay, you know what though? Yandu's fucking arrow that he has in Guardians is so fucking cool. You want a taste? Sure. Nah, I'm good, kid. I I'm gonna be real with you, kid. You you kick my ass. It's gonna look really bad in prison. You want a taste? I gotta work on my fight. He's gonna be that guy you just beat up is gonna be somebody's bitch when he goes back to Rikers. I, I'm telling you, man. I'm not gonna let you hit me. You okay? Hey, so uh. Don't freak out, but um, I just beat up Star Dude, Star Lord. I think the Guardians are gonna kick my ass now. He really does look like he really kind of does look like Star Lord, not the MCU one, but the um. Anything else happens here? I'll let you know. Great, thanks, Miles. The um uh, the video game Star uh, Star Lord. I know which one he's hitting next. The one with the cool ass album. Earthquake and or demolition derby at the Harlem Center. Sounds like our boy. Headed there now. I would love to play I would love to play Zero to Hero right now, but I I don't want to get copyright claimed by the by the fucking Guardians of the Galaxy. I play like five seconds of of the theme song and literally the fucking uh the, the Moan. What what was the name of the ship? The Moanin? Jason Momoa? I actually do. what what Milan? Mal what is what is the Guardians of the Galaxy ship called? Milanin, Melania Trump. I don't I don't fucking know. It's literally the ship. Its navigation system is just voiced by Melania Trump. We're going to go get. You need to go get the pickles. Ship name. I never seen that full speech. I've only seen that one clip where she's just talking about pickles, and like that's the only thing I know about her, because <laughs> it's just so fucking funny. Ship name. Okay, what is it called? The Milano. Oh, that's what I was thinking of Melania. Yeah, it's similar, sort of. Yeah, man, that ship got blown up like three times. 
I remember at the end of like Guardians 2, I thought I thought that Ravenger ship, the head, was gonna be the actual like ship now. I kinda wish they went for like a new ship design and stuff. But you know what? I, I like the design of the Milano, it kinda looks like a fucking bird. I like how it shows up in uh, that one uh, Guardians of the Galaxy ride, which by the way, that's a really fun ride. I'm sad that we had to lose Tower of Terror over it, but you know, it's fun. I'll probably go if it's still available whenever I decide to visit Florida. That god awful state. Yes, to any new viewers, I don't like Florida. It's like, it's, it's like scarier California. It's hot. You got a whole bunch of you got a whole bunch of crazy people running around. The only thing that's different is that that you guys have out you guys have living dinosaurs, and we have meth heads. That's the next. Uh, that's the next. Uh, uh, versus movie: meth heads versus dinosaurs. It's gonna, we're gonna we're gonna see fifteen meth heads versus a T Rex. Speaking of dinosaurs, is a weird is a weird transition going from meth heads to dinosaurs. We you know what? Fuck it. I've had weirder transitions. Uh it was a game I remember seeing. I don't fucking remember what the fuck it was called. Uh it's it's on the tip of my tongue. Uh, what? Yeah, okay, I'll describe it if you know what it is. Uh, it has a. Uh, it has um Vin Diesel in it. I remember that. It, it's a game that has to. It, going back to the whole Guardians of the Galaxy thing, we go to Vin Diesel. Uh, what the fuck was it? Was it Ark? Is that the one I'm thinking of? Is that Ark? Because I swear to God, I remember seeing like a dinosaur, a Vin Diesel riding like a T Rex and stuff with the with the uncanny valley look and stuff, where it's just like. It sort of looks like Vin Diesel, but it also looks like it sees death. It has that weird stare that that Seth Rogen troll had in in that Chippendale movie. I think it's yeah, I think it's Arc Two, the other one. Yeah. I don't know. I'm probably not gonna play it, but I was just thinking of it right now. I guess talking about Guardians of the Galaxy and dinosaurs led me there. There is no one by side. What are you talking about? The fucking Hulk. Thanos? Pro probably Thanos. I'm going to start new Avengers. You'll join the Avengers, so I thought, hey, why not? Let me join let me join another superhero team. But Rhino, you're not a superhero. Oh, don't be discriminating, Spider-Man. That's not very cool of you. Oh fuck. So what's the end for these particular means? Spider-Man, for somebody who who is a mutant freak, you're very you're very prejudiced, man. That's not very cool. Not very I can't think of You can't swing. You can't swing that I, I don't know. I can't I can't think of anything about um I can't think of anything spider related and open mindedness. <laughs> I kind of like this suit, though. There we go. Sweet. I don't know. Maybe it's just it's just the robotic like kind of like suits and stuff. It, it just looks really cool. I'm a sucker for robotic suits. But for some reason, he looks like a fucking mech. I, I don't know why. I don't know why Rhino looks like a fucking mech. He's a, he's, a, he's a new Gundam generation. <laughs> no 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 no. He's an he's an Ava he's an Ava unit. <laughs> Next, they're gonna send <laughs> they're gonna send Rhino to fight the angels. <laughs> Look out, Rhino! Poachers! 
That is not funny, Spider-Man. Poaching is a very pro is a very big problem, especially if you are a dentist. Nobody likes poachers, not even Craven. And that motherfucker kills people and hunts people. I don't know why he hunts people. He he got problems. People say we're related, but that's very rude. That's not true. I'm not that I may be a crazed maniac, but I'm not that crazy. I'll beat up people and impale them, but I won't hunt them. Who hunts people? Who the fuck hunts people? Who the fuck is this, Rambo? Like, why would you hunt somebody? That makes no sense. Anyway, Spider-Man, I do like our chats that we have with while we're trying to kill each other. It's really nice. You're like my buddy. Hey Spider-Man, you want to you want to go get you want to go get smoothies after this? I know very good I I'm a big fan of Jamba Juice. <laughs> You're not a smoothie guy, I know very good coffee shops too, Spider-Man. Let's wrap this up. You look like a mocha you look like a caramel macchiato kind of guy. Never send an eight-ton infant. Don't get America. Scorpion anything though. He gets stung Let's up by caffeine. Yes, Scorpion. Fuck off. Nobody likes you. You're just crazy Spider-Man. Nobody likes crazy Spider-Man. Oh, cool. I forgot we can get. Did he just make the fucking Cinema Sins sending? That literally sounded like the fucking cinema sense noise. And I hate that that's. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm thinking of fucking I'm thinking of fucking Rhino as a member of Cinema Sins. I did not They put mild inconveniences. Too many mild inconveniences. That's a sin. I know, what the fuck was that? I don't want to touch his skin, that's weird. You sound like Craven now. Who, who the fuck wants to be Craven? That guy's crazy. Jesus, Scorpion. What the fuck is wrong with you? I just want to kick his ass, that's it. Not fucking wear his skin. Who the fuck are you, the Predator? <laughs> I like how ecstatic my fucking voice is getting out from this shit. I love the fact that we just fucking did that to Scorpion. Hit him with the trip webs and just fucking lunged into a carrying crate. Or cargo crate or whatever the fuck these things are called. Cargo carrying crate, that's not that's not what these are, but it's whatever. Uh because I'm not superhero? I don't have spiders. Rhinos don't have spider sense. I know, I don't like him. Who the fuck wants to hang out with a guy named the Scorpion anyways? Hey Spider-Man, I bet you 20 bucks. Scorpion's favorite character in Mortal Kombat is Scorpion, that fucking narcissist. Oh god, Scorpion's dead. <laughs> oh god, we killed him. <laughs> he goes, uh, Spider-Man, this is not good. We got to hide the body somewhere. Don't worry, this is the only time you and Rhino get to team up. We got to hide the body. Don't worry, Spider-Man, I can keep secret. Rhinos are known for keeping secrets. That was very cool description of your fist, Spider-Man. Fist of Fury, I didn't see that coming. Pretty cool, man. Oh fuck, I forgot we don't- we can't web him. Alright, come here. Huh. A little off, but that could have worked. Wait, what? Yo. I 
I am very good poet. He's I am like my idol, Bill Shakespeare. Spider-Man, have I told you I've been listening to fr I've been watching French films now? I enjoy I enjoy the art. It's, it 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 appeases the mind. It's good for the soul. It is good to learn new things, like my like my hero Tony Soprano has said. It's good to learn new things, Spider-Man. I think after I think after we battle, I would like to show you Amelia. It's a very good film. I'll make you I'll make you a a, a souffle too. I've been taking baking. I'm trying to become a new man, Spider-Man. I'm trying to show the the sensitive side of, of Rhino. Not just the brute, but the man. A little force together time might help you boys learn to play nice. You are right, Spider-Man. I did learn this in therapy. Rhino Scorpion, why don't you talk about your feelings right, with me? <laughs> Scorpion just like, what the fuck? Something tells me they won't be as easy. I'm not fucking talking with you. <laughs> I'm not fucking, I'm not fucking using, talking to a guy dressed up like a rhino as my therapist. You shouldn't be judging, right, at Scorpion? Nothing less from our beloved mayor. Leaf Devil's breath to me. One of my best people is on it. How long have you wanted to be a Scorpion, Scorpion? <laughs> Do you actually like being called Scorpion? Why don't I call you by your regular name? I don't know it, but you know what? I'll call you it. You can tell me. Are you thinking his pet house? Why do you hate Spider-Man so much? He's a pretty cool guy. Sure, I like, sure we fight, but it's really just exercise at the end of the day. It's good to exercise with your buddies. Can we be buddies, Scorpion? Okay. Fuck no. Alright, I'm, do I'm done doing Rhino's bit. Goodbye for now. Okay, so that was fucking weird. So what am I doing? Uh, stepping into the parlor. Isn't- Oh, this is that stealth mission where we gotta break into Norman's place. We do get a weapon here, so it's kind of cool. They give her a shotgun. Yeah, it just turns into- a, it just turns into Doom Eternal. She gets she gets the Doom Guy HUD and everything where it's his face. Okay, MJ. I'm a couple it's just his away. fucking face on the camera. Thanks, Pete. Wish me luck. All right, enough of me fucking around. Okay. Norman's penthouse is on the top floor, but the elevator's on lockdown. Ah, Mary Jane Watson, you're trying to break into Mr. Osborne's place? Okay, right this way. Excuse me, the lobby seems pretty busy. Is everything okay? Residents have been asked to uh, temporarily vacate their units while Sable International performs a security sweep. Okay. Have people been waiting down here long? No, no. Only one or two hours. We all greatly appreciate Sable International's generous assistance with security. You, you, you can see him, like, slowly putting the fucking check of a billion dollars back in his suit pocket. Sable International's the best kind of company. Has the penthouse been affected? Oh my, no. The new security room in the back of the lobby ensures that the mayor remains totally undisturbed. Here we go, random stranger I just met. Here's the password. Good luck. He'll never survive this. Next election, he'll get destroyed. Maybe. I've seen Osborne survive worse. He is a cockroach. An arrogant cockroach in a starched suit. Somebody even say a goblin as such. Not really a cockroach, but a goblin. Envious of, with green. I never seen him. There's the security room. But that guard will see fucking nice. This is a nice ass lobby. God damn. Maybe I can I would love to live in a I would love to live in an apartment complex like this is fucking cool. You ordered DoorDash and shit. They gotta go they gotta go through this fucking Sick ass place. I think the one thing that Loki kind of. I'll talk about it more. Limits, this is a Spider Man game. I don't give a fuck what you have to say, cop. I'm gonna find a new vantage point. I'm gonna go here. Damn you, invisible walls. Damn you. I 
found the stairs. Game, I found the stairs. Let me in. Let me in. Please. Uh, uh, let's let's try this door. No. Let me pull the fire alarm. Everybody will start freaking out, going, "Oh no, the fire is going crazy!" Ooh. Oh. That's the elevator to Norman's penthouse. Just need to unlock it. You can have a private elevator. That sounds awesome. I want a private elevator. Be fucking cool. All right, so pickpocket a cop and take the key. All right, sounds fair. Why isn't Osborne down here? This sort of thing never happens to him. The mayor and his friends are exempt. Security let one of his biggest donors back upstairs right away. I knew it. It's all one big boys club. Come on. Yeah. Yeah, finish your car finish your sentence before walking off, you dick. Ugh. Every second we stay down here, we risk catching that plague. Definitely stay away from the receptionist. Been coughing up a storm. What? They have to let us back upstairs. Do they now? I don't know, lady. You look very goblin like. They treat us like animals. Oh, we're inciting a riot. Okay, cool. I'll screw you into the ground. Let us upstairs before. Ah. We left my stupid inhaler upstairs. I heard they'll let you up if you claim special circumstances. Okay, so we're inciting a riot. Really? Nice. Come on. Let's go talk to security. Mary Jane Watson. That should do. The insider. <laughs> Jerry, get out here. We got a situation. Oh, man. I can't... Much! Let me Bring me the head. police officer's head! I, to get to the door without being seen. Everyone I wish to bathe there. in their blood. The International has nearly finished their sweep. That's what you said an hour ago. I know this is Hey, officer, that lady's walking in. Sable is doing this for your safety. Officer, if you care so much, why did that woman just walk in? Because it's like, oh, shit. God damn it, we are so fired. You know, we could probably call this in, but you know what? Let's see how far she gets. Why not? She's probably a video game character or something. Hello? Oh, sweet. A taser. Agents who would love to meet you. Wait. Now, I'm not, I'm not a cop or a firearm specialist, but wouldn't that... Isn't that a stun gun? Like, not a taser, but a stun gun? Oh, I gotta get behind him. Taze. Now I your like spine's. Now, now he can no longer use his spine. Sweet. But um, as anyways, I was saying. Uh, isn't that a yeah? That's a stun gun, right? And usually stun guns, they fire, they fire the taser. I'm not. I, I don't know much about when it comes to like tasers and shit, but elevator controls and the security. That, that looks like that little box thingy was where the barbs are and stuff. Mary Jane Watson, super spy. Time to unlock that elevator. Also, the Crippler breaks everybody's spines. Turn them in the. Turn the Joe Swans. That's so yeah. fucked up. And the elevator's unlocked. It's me. Time to head upstairs. Oh, Joe, how did you end up in that wheelchair? Well, I was. I can't. I can't do a fucking Patrick Warburn. I can only do it. Hey, me. I was walking in, and I got tased in the back. Let's see. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Can I take? Can can I tase Norman Osborne? Hello there, Mr. Osborne. How you doing? Wait. But that's Mary Jane. Oh, it's okay. You can shoot her. Penthouse elevator. This what if it. Norman sees me? What happens? Will they shoot me if I'm? Wait. I. I'm not even doing anything. I wasn't even near them. That's. Penthouse elevator. This is it. Jesus Christ! The Sable agents are trigger happy. Norman and Sable, right on cue. Like, man, oh my god! The fr the Norman's just like, only I can be the only right head in the building! <laughs> Mr. Mayor, I think there is someone in the bu- in that- in that elevator. Okay, never mind. 
answer your phone call. I'm sure it's important. Hello, Joe's Pizza. I'd like a one. I would like a large pepperoni. Oh, yes, very important, Mr. Mayor. Hiding something up here. Pepperoni pizza is very important. It's good for you. You use it to sustain your to stabilize your hunger. Mr. Osborne, your 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 house's AI is going crazy. Mr. Osborne, wouldn't it be crazy if you put? You probably might want to put your Doctor Doom helm into way. What is this thing? Who is Doctor Doom? Hello, hello, Mary Jane. I see you found my Doctor Doom helmet. I'm going to use this to make goblins. <laughs> now you may be wondering, where is Harry? That's a secret. Ah, don't worry. You can look at the secret. You're a good kid. I'm going to use this to make a flight. I'm going to use this to be my goblin. Blueprint for the apartment. Tons of empty space right behind the wall with a family portrait. Who leaves space unused in a Manhattan apartment? MJ, what? Why does this say goblin room? I think Norman's being moved. Worried they might spot me. I might have had something to do with Can it. Can I play Moonlight Sonata? Keep your distance. I should open be up okay the open up the staircase. That's what happens in Resident Evil, right? I've never played one, but all I know is there's a scene where Jill Valentine plays Moonlight Sonata. And I think that's like attached to a puzzle, so yeah. That's a swinky that was a nice ass fireplace though. Oh, okay, there is a vent. I was like, how do you not worry about smoke? The only s Mary Jane, you you don't realize work order for a keypad lock. Looks like he used Harry's last day as the code. That must be the day Harry left for Europe. That must be the day where Harry is no longer human. What is this? Harry is more than human now. Doors are locked till the system check finishes. What the fuck was that? What the fuck? What was this? Say? S Swilito? Swilco. Swilco. And sup. <laughs> Just sup. You got you got uh green goblin green and you got uh blue. Just blue I would be very I I would be very su suspicious if I got a drink and it was that fucking green. I'm just I'm just saying, I I don't know that something about that drink looks awfully suspect, so I'm just like this goblin goo. It's goblin DNA in there. It's how, it's how he plans to infect the city. That's like that really dumbass plot from... From fucking the Hulk. Oh. Huh. The goblin ma- I'm kidding. I know these are supposed to be like masks and stuff, and I like to think of this one. He's like, I really like this one. It's very green. I like things that are green. I like how my, my Willem, my, this is, if you can't tell, I'm trying to Willem Dafoe, but it's like, it's for some reason, just Alex Jones. Osborne, boys. Norman bids his son farewell. Hmm. This must be from when Harry left for Europe last year. Why was Norman so dramatic about a trip to Europe? Hmm. Secret keypad behind the family portrait. Norman must like spy movies. <laughs> you can guess I like fire doors. We have fire doors. You have doors made of fire. I could be back any minute. Need to find that keypad. Of course. Harry's last. I like. I know he left last summer, but was it July or August? This is a nice ass. This is a nice ass kitchen. Big ass fuck, but it's like. You'd be surprised if Norman has ever even touched the stove. 
kind of looks like my oven. Yeah. Just put a little thing in the middle and stuff, and you basically get. This looks like my oven, so. You got two. Uh, oh, I know, it's a dishwasher. <laughs> I was like, damn, fucking, these guys are going all out. They got fucking two ovens in here. Got, gonna make so many cakes. You may be wondering, what do what cakes do have to do? Like rich people. Wonder if all this wine is from Norman's vineyard in Burgundy. Who puts butt? Look at all the soda he has here. <laughs> of course, I, I like to be. I can't afford Mountain Dew, Mary Jane, so I had to fill it with this, this Incarian knockoff, Swilco. You can taste, you can taste the bootleg. I couldn't even, I could, I gotta be honest with you, Mary Jane, I couldn't even afford Dr. Di- oh, wait, no, it's Dr. Pepper. Uh, what the fuck is it? Mountain Blast? Is that what that shit's called? The fucking bootleg uh, Mountain Dew, is it about? Is it Mountain Blast? Norman locked up Harry's room. Wants it untouched for when Harry returns from Europe. Is there anything in the back? Where did he put the key? Man, whoever fucking was eating here does not know how to clean up after themselves. I thought these were supposed to be rich people, not pigs. Harumph. That's a nice ass pool. That's a jacuzzi. Holy shit. I thought it was a pool for a second. I was like, God damn, that's a tiny pool. No, that's a jacuzzi. That's the pool. Ugh, Norman would have a pool. New York is about subway rats and street pizza, not sunbathing and umbrella drinks. Who the fuck wants, who the fuck praises rats? What the fuck? <laughs> that's the weirdest thing I've ever heard. <laughs> that sounds like something you would hear in a fucking Always Sunny episode. Especially from fucking Charlie Kelly or some shit. Not fucking Mary Jane Watson. I I never heard somebody praise rats. I can understand Subway, I guess. That's that's cool. Uh but fucking rats? Okay, this is a sweet ass this is a sweet ass living room. I'm not a fan of the couches, but you know what? God. Pete and I loved coming over here to watch movies when we were kids. A different world from Queens. <laughs> Funny how Harry always wanted the opposite. But nothing made him happier than watching cartoons on the little TV in May's kitchen. Yeah. I mean... It's two different respects. You got rich and you got middle class. Of, co of course. Fucking kids growing up in that shit would probably want something a little more tamer. And vice versa and stuff. You got everything but you want less. Yeah. I probably would want that if I would, if I had everything, honestly. Fuck it. What the fuck? Is that just a bottle cap? Oh no, they're just buttons. I thought he... kind of cute. Norman keeps all the campaign buttons from his races. There's one for school board. And he's left room for more. Setting your sights higher, Norman? What is this pumpkin-shaped device? Why does it look like a bomb? Emily's terminal diagnosis. I know Harry's mom was sick, but I had no idea it was genetic. Did Harry ever get tested? Yeah, he tested positive for goblin aids. Those, those damn goblin aids. They'll kill you, man. One moment you're green, next moment you're mean. Harry's mom planted this when he was born. Looks like Norman has made a point of caring for it now that she's gone. Beautiful. I like it's the centerpiece too of the room. It's nice. It's nice. Glad to know the maniacal maniac has that. Alright, let's go. There's some other stuff over here, so let's check. <clears throat> what the fuck, dude? It's like my fucking apartment building. Jesus Christ. Like, this is this is the size of my apartment. God fucking damn. Fucking jealous. I 
I want a fucking bathroom in this big. That's awesome. This dude got a couch in his bath. Who the fuck has a couch in their bathroom? That's awesome. Oh man, look at us. We used to be so carefree. I miss those days. Harry had glasses? Huh. Huh. He did. Yes. Nine says fun like taking a shit while overlooking the city. Hey, yo, the, oh, okay, there is a toilet in here. I was like, hey, how come... Did these guys not got a fucking... Wait, did these guys gonna, not got a valve? Like, for their to Is this an automatic... Do you just say... You know what? I could probably believe Norman Osborne would have an automatic flusher. He'll be taking a shit and just be like, flush. He seems like that kind of rich. I would get a toilet like that. That sounds fucking awesome. I like devices that let me be lazy in every single circumstance. I don't know why this floor just looks off. I get it's supposed to be like it's a, it's supposed to be Harry and his be family. So jealous of Harry's family. I, I don't know. It's so just, it's just the mom. At least compared to me and my dad. Like the <laughs> the everything changed. Like it's a, it's a nice photo, but for some reason it's just I can't get over the fact it just looks like a really weird Photoshop. <laughs> It's just like you got this random stock photo of the mom and his and her baby, and you just got fucking Norman Osborne just made a photo. You know, it'd be really funny if like Norman didn't have a family, and this is just the only photo. Like, th there's no Harry or anything. He just has this random fucking Photoshop photo. <laughs> so fucking weird. Look at all this. Norman certainly likes to remind guests of his status. The photo was removed, though. Wonder what was there. Boom. And uh, it's I, I actually I I don't know what that says, but I don't know why I read that as Fuma. <laughs> Norman is the foam master. <laughs> the foam master. It's a weird. That's a weird name. The foam master. <laughs> okay, whose room is it? What the fuck? Bigger than my entire apartment. Dude. Now I feel sad. I know it's a video game. God, am I fucking jealous of this dude? The one I'm wondering, it's gonna suck like hell when you spill water on the floor. God damn. Shit, man, this is a fucking cool ass bathroom. Alright, let me check over here. Is this the photo? Norman and Otto. Wow. They look like they used to be so close. What could have ruined a friendship like this? Goblins. Goblins mainly. Wait, 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 wait. I don't know if uh, 737 has anything to do with it. I'm just going to keep that in mind. Probably not, but I'm still going to look around and stuff, see what we can find. I don't know. Something, something about this angle of having your, having your chair that fucking close to the TV when it's that high up just seems kind of weird. I feel like, like right here would be kind of cool. Just like... I don't know. I don't like the idea of looking straight up at a TV. It's like... Like, I'd rather, like, somewhere right here seems okay. Like, that seems cool, yeah. I don't know, up there, that's weird, man. That's a, that's a weird place to have your TV. Alright, let's uh, try to see if we can find other rooms. Hey, Dad. On my way to Dr. Oh, Michael, fuck! I just scared the fuck out of my cat's under my cat's under my desk, and it scared the shit out of me right now. <laughs> I just Fine. Want to record some thoughts. How you doing? Bon voyage day. <laughs> uh, She's like anyway, I just felt like something brush up against my leg and I'm like, what was that? Say this enough, but thank you, Dad. 
I don't have a camera, and I would sh I would love to show her, but I love you. I don't want a camera, wow. so. Oh, well. I haven't heard Harry's voice in so long. He sounds so tired. Very goblin-like. Still here. Gotta check his room. Where is his room? That's the thing. City's in a state of emergency, but Norman still manages to get his laundry and cleaning done for him. What a hero. Like, ha half the size of this laundry room is literally the size of my room. A little bigger. Maybe a little bigger. Alright, where is Harry's room? Give me a sec. My cat starts banging at the door like that. And she wants to get out. I don't know how the hell she's... Maybe she's able... She pulls the little thing, the door up from underneath. Because there's like... I used to have this hinge for the... Um, that's supposed to separate the hallway from the kitchen from my room and stuff but it broke off so it's like this like tiny little area underneath the door so i guess that's where she's pulling it's fucking annoying what she does in the middle of the night and you're trying to sleep but hey part of me i don't know why i thought of this at one point but then i realized it's fucking disgusting if i did that i don't know why one time i was just like yeah maybe i'll just put my cat's litter box in my room yeah it's like a small like fucking cat shit in here yeah it's totally a good idea i didn't i, w I wouldn't nasty but I, I don't know why i had that idea man it was a late night idea so maybe that's why harry's room but it's locked i wonder where norman keeps the key in here Bang at the door. Huh? Alright, uh, where, where's that key at? We can check. It. Let's. Should we check Norman's room? Yeah. Let's check Norman's. See what he's got. Anything in the drawers? No, I don't see anything. Man, for a paper that's like 20 years old, that shit looks brand new. God damn. Never really takes care of it. Oh, I thought that was Uncle Ben for a second. I was like, why does Norman have a photo of Uncle Ben? Harry's mom, Emily. We used to make fun of him for calling her the prettiest mom at Midtown, but he might have been right. <laughs> Harry's mom was a MILF. Score. This must be the key for Harry's room. Maybe that's why. No, I'm just playing. Because going back to what I said of why does why does Norman have a photo of Uncle Ben? I was like, oh my god. Aunt May was the reason. Going back to why Uncle Ben died, he wasn't shot by a random mugger. No, Aunt May paid him off because Uncle Ben, and Norman Osborne were lovers. What? This can't be. She didn't approve of them. Oh, hey, look, it's Harry's Gamer Lab. Harry's journal. His last entry is marked July 18. That must be the code to that room. Okay, 0718. Leaving for Europe today, ha! Huh. Not sure how it's going to go. Not sure, yeah, how this is going to go. Dad said there, Dad says there's no risk, but that's Dad. Dr. Michaels thinks it's, a, it's, like, it's more like 50-50. So, okay, I might not make it. If that happens, I bet you'll be reading this, Dad. Who am I kidding? You're probably reading it anyway. Norman always, Norman has to always know. So, if you are reading this, Dad, and if no risk at all turns out to be another Osborne campaign promise, then do me a favor. Show this next part to Pete and MJ. Just them. Please. Thanks, Dad. Love you. To Peter Parker and Mary Jane Watson. Guys, I'm sorry. Really sorry. If you're reading this, man, this is tough. Even an imagined hypothetic in a hypothetical letter to you, 
It's harder to it's hard to be honest. Here goes. I'm sick. Like really sick. Doctors think it's the same thing mom had. Neuro neurodegeneration. Rapid onset. I've known for a while, but thought I could manage it. I didn't tell you cause well because I didn't tell you. I was worried how do you react to it. I I was worried how do you react. React. I couldn't stand to see you go through what I what I did with mom. Watching her suffer and knowing I couldn't help. Watching her die was worse than the dying. Things got really bad recently. Although the time although the times I would yeah, although the times I was wiped out from partying or just super busy, not partying, not busy, sick. This Europe trip, well, it's a cover. I'm going in for treatment, experimental long term. Dad's been working on it forever. Promises it's it'll work. He hates the nickname the techs have for it, Devil's Breath. Says it makes something good seem scary. Maybe Devil's Breath is what I need. Little bit, little bit of bad to do with all the good. Okay, Dad. Okay, Dad's here. Time to go. Did he really write? Okay, Dad's here. Time to go. <laughs> like it's a fucking audio recording. The fuck, Harry. I am saying we should not rush off without a plan. Why? Why does Harry write like he's you fucking doing an audio here. recording? The antiserum's ready, and I'm going to supervise production. You will be completely. And I'm gonna expose all the stories and stuff. To be completely vulnerable with you. I'm going alone. End of discussion. Keep team two on standby. I'm getting somewhere. <gasps> Alright, I'm all right, I'm back. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. I can just do this. Doodle chop! Well, I got something that will give you a little shock. <laughs> Stealth. Wait. What are you doing, Mary Jane? You could just rush him. Just go boom, stab him. There you go. Norman's curious. Didn't ready. really make that noise. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Judo chop. Look out. Hey, yo, go check that out, man. Really cool. Fuck. Should have been should have hid behind that thing, yeah. It's alright. Pete, Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? Not without alerting him. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Hey. Wait! Control, I've That's on me. That's on me. Norman's cure is ready. He's headed to the lab it's at now. Can you follow? I am Mary Jane coming out there for. Somebody spiked Sable's coffee today. Her men are set on double secret probation alert. Okay, then stay ready. I've almost got the location. Oh. It's a taser to the back. Anyone else? I'm just gonna take out all the Sable guards, cause why not? No responding. Can someone get eyes on SA seventy seven? Oh dear that oh lord oh lord, you can see me, not good. Taste to the back. Where's the other guy? I don't know why she's able to see people like that, but you know what? We'll just report it. We'll just uh, chalk it down to investigative journalism. The greatest superpower. 
Is that the last card? Uh, I think so, yeah. Okay. Let's keep going, folks. 0718. Okay. Boop, boop, July 18. Bingo. July? I am not. July is the 7th. Yeah, I think I think um I think I might get some coffee after this or something to wake myself up. I thought that was somebody in Super there. Super creepy. Got up with spiders. Is Norman trying to reverse engineer Peter's abilities? Yes. The labels on Oh his god. Oscorp owns Twitch. Optical camouflage. Oh god damn it. That means I can't, that means I'm going to get banned for making all the os the fucking goblin jokes. Oh man. A year's worth of streams down the toilet just because of a couple goblin jokes. Oh man. If you're reading this, I'm planning to ban the streamer known as Lupin Kai for all his cruel goblin jokes made against me, the CEO. What is it really capable of, Norman? With just a little more research, I know we could perfect it. Instead, I'll spend the next 18 months on PR mop-up. What a waste of time. Devil's breath isn't a disease. It's an attempt at a cure. I almost can't believe it. I don't know, calling something a cure, calling a cure devil's breath is probably not the best description for a cure. Can you imagine when penicillin was first created, they called it fucking voodoo destruction? Or Satan semen? We- Doctors, we found the cure for cancer! I introduce... <laughs> demonic screams! Prototype hand grenades? Oh god, uh, they actually really are making fuck. They actually are making the fucking setups of the Green Goblin. Oh my god, <laughs> I love it. Why? Why is this one orange and the shape of a pumpkin? What? Well, something's something's making bubbles in there. It's got a jacuzzi in there. I knew what Osborne was working on a secret jacuzzi this whole time. That mad, that mad bastard. Be the secret to relaxation all around the world. Wow, Norman wins the fancy map contest. Looks like the Upper West Side. The Upper West Side. Looks like Norman's tracking Doctor Michael's movements. Creep fest. Huh. This shows all of Oscorp's properties. I mean, it's not often what I Wade Enterprises does. Is so much of New York. Sable troop deployments. You're stationed all over the city. I bet I can find the Devil's Breath Lab with this. It must be an Oscorp property with a ton of sable protection, frequented by Dr. Michaels. Is that it? Right there? Is that, is that it? Nope. That's just a sable patrol. Bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded op- None of these patrols cross Dr. Michaels' path. Commercial building- Wow. Oscorp's- No. A records facility could be Bravo, 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 and this must be the C team. Uh, no, Dr. Michaels was near a lot of Sable forces, but it's not an Oscorp facility. Oscorp's going all in on defense research. No, Norman's not crazy enough to keep the. Nope, that's just a Sable patrol. Dr. Strom, isn't he a robotics expert? No movement from Dr. Van Adder. Isn't he, he dead? Is he Dr. dead? Michaels, no. I need to track Michaels. Van Adder is a Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. A records facility could be perfect cover for the Devil. Where do these three categories overlap? That must good old Alpha T. Devil's Breath Lab should check the patrol routes against Oz. No. I need to track my bet I'm looking for a heavily guarded Oscorp. The Van Adder is a Dr. Michaels leads the Devil's Breath team. Sorry, there he is. This isn't right. It's good old nuts. Alpha Team. Nah, Alpha Team don't know shit. 
Oscorp's going on. No. A records facility could be perfect cover for Devil's Breath Lab. Must have a big that, table. That's right. GR27. Yeah. That's the code name for Devil's it's Breath. The B, it's the B it's team. It? Something cathedral. Isn't that... The Babel Bards. I knew it. Tenth and Cathedral, Oscorp's records department. Perfect place to hide a secret biotech facility. GR27. The fuck is GR35? It's like the only other listing one. And we are rolling. I will be right next door. Just relax and let the medicine do its work. Oh my god, they're gonna give him goblin aids. Those bastards, he's just a child. He's just a boy, Norman. So the ne the powers of his negativity are to spawn from the goblin goo. What have, you done? what have you done, Norman? You gave him the goblin aids. Norman and Otto. They started all this. They created Lee. Yep. Usually the case. Oh, hello, random spider. Are you plot convenient? Oh no, you're plot convenient. It sounds like somebody is in the experimental jacuzzi room. Come on, come on, come on. We can't let them learn about this, about these saunas, the sauna jets. If they could, if the public learns of these saunas, we are fucked. No, nobody's in the secret jacuzzi yeah. room. Hello, hi there. <laughs> Mind if I? St I'm the exposition spider. We have a breach. High alert. I'm gonna hang out here in your pocket. Don't mind me. I'm here to deliver exposition for later. Also plot conveniences, but don't worry about that. He, You're not destined for me to bite you. A lot more. I'm looking for another. A Mr. Morales. Say the word and I'm there. Great. Keep the motor running. I like how when I walk in the walls I'm just like slow mo <laughs> Well, can I just taste save when we win the game? Miss Watson, you could use me and I will bite them and infect them with my spider stuff. I don't have venom. No. I only have plot convenience. But sadly, me offering to bite them will not do anything. So I'm just gonna hang out here in your pocket. <laughs> Mary Jane, let me ask you something while I'm hanging out here. Do you know a Miles Morales? No? Oh, okay. I was told by Madam Webb he is very important. I must find Miles Morales. I must give him my powers. And then I can head back to Planet Spider. Oh no, Mary Jane, you must run. I must be alive to deliver my powers. If you... Mary Jane, you must ask this Peter if he knows a man by the name of Miles Morales. Hey, you ready? He is important. He is important to my goals. <laughs> Don't worry, Mary Jane. I have the power of luck on our side. You are crazy. I can summon Spider-Man at will. <laughs> but it it is Madam Webb's will that I make it to Miles. Your death is will not happen.
It's all so much to take in. Harry sick, Norman and Lee, and Dr. Octavius? I know. I also saw a hidden secret jacuzzi, but I couldn't check it out because I didn't push the button. Again. You are not alone anymore, Kate. Let Miles and me look after Feast. You, you find Norman. You find the cure. Thanks, partner. Ew, cooties. Hey, hey, from being in your pocket, I can sense that you love that man. to get that anti-serum and start putting things right. There must be some way to reach Lee and Otto. Convince them to give up this Somebody seemed to off about Mary Jane today. I, I kept hearing a voice, the but they can't throw their legacies away. It was talking about some Norman. it was I don't know why. Okay. It kept mentioning so Miles a lot. I don't I don't know. Better update Yuri. Well, why? I I don't, I don't know. Mary news. Jane doesn't have it mental is. doesn't have I'll mind powers. Why was I hearing a voice in the background of a British man saying, find Miles Morales? I'm on my way to find out. The lab is at 10th and who is Madam Webb? I don't know who that is. Got a report of a helicopter going down in that area. Oh, shit. I'd send officers your way, but I don't have any. Don't worry, I'm on it. I do not have cops and... I promise. I do not have fucking cops. Well, I guess if you have super... If you got fucking Spider-Man, you don't want to worry about the cops. Spider-Man's on the case. You know, technically, we could fast travel. Yeah, I just realized that. Let's go do that real quick. Oh, I thought I thought we got unlocked. That was missions, but I thought it said we unlocked a new skill, and I was like, oh, cool. I think we can unlock one more suit before, um, uh, what you would call it? Until these are DLC, so we won't get those for a while. I'm wondering if we're gonna be able to. Be I don't know if we're gonna beat this game this stream, actually. It seems like that might happen, so we'll see. So we're actually very close to the end of the game. Like, for real. <laughs> Boss, why are you doing that? I thought we were cool. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, just don't suck the negativity out of me. Come, we must infiltrate the Twitch building. We must get Lupin Kai as Twitch partner. Have to take care of these demons before I can follow Lee into the lab. Time to KO those snipers. Let me get this guy right. There we go. Hello. Good night. Any more? Is there just this guy? It's this guy and the guy with the rocket. Good night, my friend. Oh. 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 My goodness. His head. His head. What's going on with this head? Oh god, he got elongated. Sleep it off. to get through these demons quick before Lee gets a hold of the anti-serum. <laughs> Fuck, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, no. Oh, well, fuck it. Spider-Man, leave now. My men will handle this. Sable? Lee wiped out the agent stationed here. They're not handling anything. You have been warned. Hero. By the way, Spider-Man, if you don't mind me asking, how did you come up with your name? It sounds very cool. You don't seem like the creator. Where did you get Spider-Man from? Well, Yuri, it's a, it's a funny thing you asked me. 
So, uh, one day I was, uh, I got bitten by a spider, and I figured, you know, most people when they get superpowers, they think, oh, I'm gonna spike crime. Nah. I felt like fighting, uh, I felt like fighting Macho Man Randy Savage. Oh, yes, I've heard of him. He's very popular here in Simcarnia. He's very, he was, he was given the key to the country. He is our national hero. <laughs> So, I uh, figured I fight him, and then before I started the fight, I met Bruce Campbell. Oh, you met Bruce Campbell! That's very cool! He is also a national hero here. And then he was like, What's your name? I was like, The Human Spider. He goes, You called yourself Human Spider? Why did you call yourself Human Spider? What kind of name is that? That sucks! I know, right? Thank God, thank God I listened to Bruce Campbell. And then he was like, the amazing Spider-Man. See? Of course, it makes sense. Yes, you'd listen to National Hero. If National Hero tell you your superhero name, you'd better listen. There's wise tale in Simcaria. If Bruce Campbell give you a name, you listen to Bruce Campbell. Bad luck happens upon you if you do not listen to... If you do not listen to Bruce Campbell. Look at his friends in Evil Dead movie. Of course, you Americans consider it a very... You Americans consider it just a movie, but here in Simcaria, it is used as fable. We worship the ash. The ashes. We hail to the king, baby. I didn't tell you, but there is a secret project that the Simcarian scientists are working on. I'm going to chop off my hand in a few months and going to replace it with chainsaw. The only problem is I might lose a lot of blood, so we're trying to come up with a better solution. I like the idea of having chainsaw hand. Very cool. I would look very cool. Maybe the Avengers will let me join now. Why are you? Who wouldn't want the guy with? Who wouldn't want somebody with a chainsaw in their hand? You harass my men. Destroy my equipment and cost my client millions. Give me one good reason I should not kill you. Spider-Man, you made me lose millions. I could use that money to for chainsaw on. There's a guy inside this building right now, and he's gonna kill him if we don't do something. Spider-Man, if you get in the way of my dream of having a chainsaw arm, I swear to God, I will kill you. Let's go get that kid. You will help me secure Norman. After that, I make no promises. Works for me. I need Norman to help me get chainsaw arm. If I can't get chainsaw arm, I'm very disappointed. You secure Osborne. I will talk to them. I call this gun conversation and the other one therapy. Okay, Lee. No more running. This ends tonight. Or negotiation, that's better. That's better. Therapy's not the good one. Find a way to reach the Martin Lee I know. The man who built Feast. Okay, I just need to figure out how to get through this thing. Am I stuck? Uh, no, don't. I think I'm stuck. Oh dear. Oh lord. Uh, let me figure out something. No worries. Mm. Hmm. Uh. Let me see if I can use a suitability or something. See if I can get myself out of here. Uh. Something that would probably launch me in the air is probably. Really? The game crash it. The stream crashes the moment. I, uh, start. What is going on, man, with fucking recording? Oh, we let that go. I'm gonna try to figure out what the fuck to do. I don't want- I don't think I have to restart a save, so I'm, like, trying to see if I can figure out- What if I jump? See if that does anything? Oh, uh, I think I, I, I'm like sort of moving. Yeah, look at that. 
Just, uh, gotta maneuver myself here, folks. Maybe aim up? Nope. I am probably gonna have to close the game and reload it. No, <laughs> I didn't mean to. There, yeah, let me restart from last checkpoint. Yeah, we're like right here, so it's fine. I'm more not done. This ends tonight. All right, I'm gonna take a second to wait for this to work real quick. Time consuming. Yay, let relaunch. But I'm hoping that the stream didn't get fucking turned off. All right, uh, hi, uh, welcome back. We're rewatching this. Oh man, man, it always sucks when uh, the stream crashes and people leave. But I can understand people wanting to leave. I'm gonna change up the the encoder real quick after the stream. So um, I'm gonna try to. I'm questioning if I want to break this up into portions. I'm not stopping. If anybody, if you're just joining in and wondering, I'm not. I'm just questioning if I, if I should uh, take a second just to. See. All right, let me. To reach the Martin Lee I know. I also need to figure out how not to get stuck in the wall again. Please do not get stuck. That sucked. Uh, go this way. Yes. Now, do I jump down the hell hole? No, probably not. I go this way. The other way in the hellhole. Way to go, but down. Okay, this looks really fucking cool. <laughs> With all the floating shit. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I know about the accident. I know what happened to your parents. My parents are dead, Spider-Man. You sound as political as Osborne. You sound very goblin-like, Spider-Man. Because of what Osborne did to me. Yeah, no, he's wrong. He's not right. I mean, he's right. You're more than your past. Don't let it control you. I tried so hard to make my parents proud. To he honor did. their legacy. But to truly honor them, Osborne must see justice. I won't let you do this, Martin. Martin, can you give me the ability to run real quick? You kind of slowed me down. Oh, okay, okay, it's, uh, it's uh, something. I don't know what. Lee's pain, his anger, his sorrow, it's fueling his power. See the victims, you've killed Spider-Man. <laughs> Fucking Mr. Negative started the Cobra unit. I just heard a scream in the distance. For. I told you I'm sorry. It was an accident. I was trying to help. Yeah. You don't help people. You use them. I'm gonna burn your ear. This won't bring your parents back. No shit. Just trying to fucking kill a goblin. I'm trying to save this piece of scum. I'm trying to save you, Martin. Oh, uh, he didn't want to say Don't shit because he knew we'd get in trouble. Oh, 
Oh yeah, I forgot you gotta throw shit at the sword guys. Well then I'm gonna just keep throwing monitors at you because you're being a fucking booby. A booby? I meant to say duty head, but I don't know why I said booby head. He's a boob head. Too slow. Oh, the. He like. He's like I can. I see you shred, Spider Man. It's pretty cool. I'm guessing I gotta build up the, the meter. Yeah, I do. I got you now, game. Switch. I always keep accidentally doing it, pressing the wrong one. Uh, battle focus, real quick. Yeah. I have no idea if he's done or not. Fight it, Martin. You can walk away. No. Osborne must suffer. Oh, Jesus, flash warning, folks. Apologize to anybody who's photosensitive there. Well, it's time to fight the demon from Far Cry 3. Let's do this. Oh, so, yeah, I gotta fight these guys in order to... Oh, sweet, I, I do have battle focus. I am the demon! Okay, so first we have I am the management team, and now we have I am the demon. Can I... I'm wondering... Nah, webbing does not work, okay. A big deal. Hmm. Yeah, that, okay, I see what I gotta do. You and Osborne, Sarah I don't wanna fucking hang out with that weird goblin guy. Fuck no. Nobody wants to share a grave with a goblin. That's weird. He talks about he talks about pumpkins and shit. It's just weird, man. I don't want to hang out with them. This will all be over soon. I sure hope so. He tries doing really weird norm. He tries to do Willem Dafoe impressions. The whole oh, okay. I did not see those guys. I thought it was just Martin this whole time. I was like, okay, just start beating him up. Yeah, well, I know how to throw shit at people. Can you? No, I didn't think so. He's almost down. Maybe learn how to throw shit at people, Martin. Then maybe you'll win. Also, learn how to heal yourself. Do I get shit I can throw at him? No, I don't have any shit I can throw at him. But I can't do this. Oh, sweet. He flinched. That means he's done. Remember, folks, when your enemy flinches, they're done. No, oh, no, he's not done. He, he wanted to go spooky demon time. Now I'm gonna kick it in the face. I'm gonna kick him in the face. That was a cool shot. Whoa, flash warning, jeez. What if it wasn't, like, in a fight? It was just them having a staring... Like, Osborne was just seeing them have a staring contest. <laughs> and it just cuts to Martin falling on the floor. Ah, uh, ah, uh, you beat me! And Norm is just like, what the fuck just happened? Ah, uh, it's Otto. Yeah. 
Otto, I failed. Useless. You're nothing but a negative fractor in my solution. Fraction, I meant to say, not fractor. Factor is the better word. I don't know, Spider-Man. Your outcome looks very negative, and Martin's just like, hey, that's my puns. You stole my line. Ah, we're fine. It's no big, it's no biggie, man. Look, look, he's fine. Spider-Man's fine. Nice catch. Auto. That look on your face. You can't imagine how satisfying it is. Ready for your final act? Not if I can't make a suit in time to kick your ass, Otto. I'll probably make it in the next five minutes. Just watch me. I'm so good at making suits. Hey. Hey. Where's Otto? Gone. I would not worry about him right now. He needs a hospital. Spider-Man. No. No hospital. If you would like, you can take my position on getting chainsaw hand. Do, would you like chainsaw hand? It's okay. We can give it to you. You want chainsaw hand? You could be like famous national hero, famous Simcardian national hero, Bruce. Wh I almost said Bruce Willis. <laughs> Bruce Campbell. Bruce Willis, not the national hey, hero. He not. There's no doctors here. Well, who's running this place? Me, mostly. Oh, okay. Well, it's been a while, but I'll do. Okay, my best. Red, okay, random fourteen-year-old. I'll Mask, take your uh, word. Gloves, right. Whatever you have, the sterile. You can thank me by not dying. Sadly, I can't do that. I got the shit kicked out oh, of me. God. No, it's just Spider-Man. He's dying. Your god is not here. Wait, is your is your god Spider-Man? Holy shit! I didn't know Spider-Man was god of New York. It makes so much sense now. Every time he says pizza time, pizza shows up. But he needs rest. <laughs> hey, take it easy. No, I can't. I gotta make a suit. Where's my? Oh god damn it, MA the MA's goblin aids are getting to her. Oh at any moment. Shit. Where are you going? I need to find Otto. He has the anti serum. I don't know if I can beat him. You can. Maybe you can't. Spider Man game, of course I can beat him. Maybe Spider Man needs help from his friend Peter. Peter's a bitch. Peter helped build those arms, remember? If anyone can find a weakness, it's him. Hey, Jane, there's no time to be existential about this. I am Peter. I don't know why you, why you said that. It's just weird. Go get him, Tiger. Don't say that. Hello, Mary Jane. I've, I've removed myself from your pocket. I must search for Miles now. Goodbye. It is Madam Webb's will. I sent him. He is somewhere nearby. 
I must find Miles Morales. All right. Hello, Miles Morales. Hello. I'm here to enact Madam Webb's will. Maybe it's this one. It's time to transfer my powers in three, oh. two. You did not need to kill me. I just simply wish to give you powers. But all right. I understand. If it isn't Madame Webb's will to die, I will die. MJ's right. I built the neural interface. That means I can destroy it. Miles, I, I now exist in your mind. <laughs> Madame Webb has made me your spirit guide. If you're if you're like a new viewer who just like joined right now and wondering what the fuck's going on. Yeah. Me too. Somebody tried to snipe me with the fucking with the with the sh I think that was a shotgun, I don't know. And you know what? Don't, don't do that. It's not okay. Don't be, don't be firing shotguns in the air at Spider-Man. Hello. Man, I gotta change this number. I must leave New York. Recent events give me pause. Your rescue of Osborne, despite his hatred, it affected me. I must return home. Reflect on this life I choose. Dang. I think I'm actually gonna miss you and your death troopers. Unfortunately, my agents will stay. Though I question that work, they do not. And Osborne continues to pay. I am sorry. That's so fair. close to being good news. Indeed. I will miss you and your bizarre witticism, Spider-Man. Until we meet again. What a strange Don't worry, Spider-Man. I will meet you in something called the DLC. The crimes do not sleep. I will see you there, because we need to fight Hammerhead. Who gives a fuck about Hammerhead? But uh, but the developer said I have to come back, so rules are rules. I think, I think I'm good on gear. Yeah. Yeah. What was it? I keep opening the pause menu. <laughs> yeah, we're good on we're good on we're good on gadgets. Skills are good, so yeah, we straight. Alright, let's go. Let's go beat up. Let's go beat up George Costanza. I'm gonna pause real quick. Hold up. The game just crashed. Well, the stream crashed, I should say. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna record, I'm not gonna show anything until we get back. I don't want you to miss this. So it's not the encoder, it's, I mean, sorry. It's not the, um, it's not the Wi-Fi that's the issue, it's the fucking... It's that fucking encoder. Yeah, it's like... I don't know what's going on with it, man. It was the third time this happened in the stream, too. It, it just went back up, I don't know. You probably couldn't hear it, but it did. Give it a moment, because the game crashed. Hey, how you doing? I, I, I missed you there, what happened? Sorry about that, folks, yeah. Um, after we beat this part, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop it. We're, we're gonna play the auto part, don't worry. The, the stream is not over yet. I promised I wanna beat this, and we are. Promises, promises. But um, what I'm going to do is, afterwards, I'm going to take a, probably like a 20 minute break between the two games. And then record. And, sorry. And then um, I'm going to talk, I don't want to talk over the cutscene, because this is actually kind of a cool cutscene. Um, I'm going to try to change up the encoder, see if that helps. If not, uh, well, shit. Yeah, uh, let's hop into the game now. Make a fucking sick ass suit. I did the impossible, Doc. But now I have to destroy it. And the little 
little creation of my own. Time for spider time. It's the whipping time. Hell yeah, baby. We looking stylish. I thought that was the drill. Alright, let's go kick Otto's ass. truth before they mop you off the pavement no! oh! tell them what you did I never oh! everything you have is built on lies lies ah! oh! <laughs> Conveniently dropped his wallet. You stole my company, my ideas. Now, the truth. Oh, those are big baby. Okay. The truth is, you were only ever worth a damn when you worked for me. The truth is, you could never accept that I'm better than you. You're a failure, Otto. And you always will be. That son of a bitch. Aw, oh, man. Thought he was gonna die. Alright, whatever. Let's go kick Otto's ass. We have to have him come back in the sequel anyways. What was that group? What the fuck is that grinning like? Mm. Give me the anti serum. Otto, you worked your whole life to help people. Please. You're fighting the wrong man. No, I'm pretty sure I'm fighting the right guy. I'm just gonna throw a whole bunch of shit at him. Keep the right shit, yeah. Dodge! There we go. Just give me the anti serum. You've already done enough to ruin Osborne. No! He always about to smack. He has to lose everything! Man, I am getting my ass handed to me. I see you have a new suit. It won't help. I know your weaknesses. I have no weaknesses. You do. It's not getting beaten like that. It's called being getting the shit kicked out of you. That doesn't do anything. Die. You're wasting my time. You're wasting my time, asshole. Gotta move. Yeah, 
Damn, he is throwing so much shit. There we go. Ooh, that's clean. <laughs> He's not going to kill him, really. Let me save the city. Then we can do whatever you want. Yeah, that sounds like not a bad plan. Yeah, by throwing random fucking objects at me, ain't gonna hurt me. Yeah, totally. Ah, uh, Otto, you fool! It's I know how to do the quick time events. Oh yeah, web bombs. I don't think about. It. How much is Osborne paying you to protect him? Uh, three slices of pizza. There we go, got him. Oh, is that it? Yeah, that's the first phase. Oh yeah, I forgot he disables your web shooters. Yeah. Nah, you... But... Nah, I'm still totally gonna kick his ass. Kick his ass, Spider Man. Got shot, you asshole. You don't offer pizza, so I will not be on your side, Otto. But I can't kick your ass. Too soon. Yeah, that's all right. I'm still gonna kick his ass though. There we go. Take that, you rapscallion. 
You look tired, Parker. Hey, Just you look tired. like you're getting your ass kicked. Just hurt. No, no stabby stab. change the world you have to be the kind of man who can make the hardest decisions <gasps> thank you for the foreshadowing i couldn't agree more he always was referred to as dr foreshadow ow ow jeez Doesn't Spider-Man actually have a feeling factor? I just forget that like he could stab so much. Jesus. We gotta get shot at, thrown off buildings, stabbed, drowned. Like what? Like let the man breathe for two seconds. Peter. Smack him in the face, go. Bad auto. Son. I should have known you'd turn on me. Just like all the others. Turn. Turn. I've worshipped you. Your mom. I supported all your streams. Wanting to help others. The way you never gave up. That's because men like us have a duty. A responsibility. Nobody wants to be a man like you, Otto. You suck. Service of others. You don't celebrate pizza time. Even if they don't appreciate it. We have to do what's best. You like pineapple on pizza. You're a criminal. Or not. No, you're wrong. You are everything I wanted to be. What kind of mother what kind of weirdo puts fruit on pizza? Threw it away. Yes, of course. You're right. You're right, Peter. The pineapple is disgusting. The neural interface. You have shown me the error of my way. Let's order Domino's right now. I'll prove it to you. We can, we can get Pizza Hut either way. Together. One of the two. If you'll help me. Oh, Otto. Do everything I can. You live in New York. Who Why gets Domino's? No. If You're not a true away. pizza fan. They'll take my arms. I'll, I'll be trapped in this. Useless body. Please, Peter. That wasn't me. It was. What the fuck? You said you'd never abandon me. You promise. Remember? God damn it. And of course. You rest easy, knowing your secret is safe with me. Is that blackmail? What you think is best, Doc? It's all any of us can. That's below you, Doc. How dare you use blackmail on me? Even when it hurts like hell. Peter, where are you going? I'm walking away. What's it look like? Peter! I'm not deaf, Doc. I'm just. This is giving him to the police. You committed a series of crimes. It's still viable. We'll need the entire sample as a base to produce more doses. How long will that take? A few hours. Maybe a day. What if we use it to cure someone right now? Then there won't be enough to cure the others. Oh, no. Not a moral dilemma. I'll give you a few minutes. What am I gonna do? Is she dying in her office? That's so fucked up. <laughs> you lived in this office, you gonna die in this office. gonna be 
okay, ma'am. I've got the cure right here. Take off your mask. I want to see my nephew. And call him a bitch to his face. Oh, there's the bitch. Look at little Spider Junior. Gonna cry? I've known for a while. I never wanted you to worry. I did. Ah, don't worry, Pete. I so I'm, I'll be dead soon. It's okay. You don't have to worry about me then. All the people. I can see him, Pete. I can see Ben. He doesn't have a bullet in him this time. I don't know what to do. Yes, you do. Let me die, Peter. Yes. You need character motivation. I will be that for you. Don't worry. No, don't put that in there. Let me die. Please. I want to go to my husband. Well, you know how I said that this I didn't like this anime because she's nothing like Marissa Tomei? Well, look at that. Now she is. Exactly like Aunt May from the MCU. It is a sad scene, though. I cried like a bitch the first time I seen this shit. I'm making so many jokes. I don't cry. I want to cry. I don't want to cry on the stream. I'm a man. I'm kidding. Here you go, let me just put this in your body. There you go. Hey, you just came back. You can't get two doses. This is really, this game's almost four years old. Yeah. I think by next month it will be four years. Holy shit! Now you won't be able to use your other arms. To get from putting pineapple on your pizza, you disgusting fuck. Do I? I'll never tell. Yo, we gonna get a Stanley cameo? So, I don't give a shit about this scene, but we gonna get a Stanley cameo? Watson, associate editor. Congrats. Thank you. I knew you could that ain't Stanley. Who is that? What about you? Find That's Lee that. Stan. Oh, no, but, uh... Bizarro oh, Stanley. Uh, thank you. Mm -hmm. I was actually considering maybe a career change. Hmm? Yeah, I think I might want to become a chef. Don't worry. <laughs> We'll come back to, come back to kick to join no, it's... Today, we're gonna to be here. we're gonna be interviewing the Spider Kitchen. The last project I worked on, I created a monster with special guest Spider Man. City, so. yeah. It's fucking raw Spider Man. I mean, tastes like a spider's asshole. What's the point, Gordon? It's a spider-themed <laughs> restaurant. You have live spiders in here. What's wrong with you? Going camping. No, I'm just oh, homeless. No, my uh, new place isn't going to be ready for about a week, so I'm going to be crashing with Miles for the next few nights. Oh. You know, you can always stay at my place. Only if you want to. No, I, I, mean, I, mean, I mean, yes, I mean, no, no I don't I not want to, but meaning I, I, I do want to, but... I'm very I'm awkward, to. Mary Jane. I never stopped wanting to. <laughs> Me either. <gasps> what? <gasps> what? He kissed him. Oh my goodness. Yeah, they... Did they eat the... Did they finish the fries, though? That's the question. Probably, I don't fucking know.
You know it would be really insane if the fucking stream crashes like right now. <laughs> I wouldn't be fucking surprised. Well, ladies and gentlemen, that was Marvel Spider-Man. Uh, we're never gonna play this game again. I, I lied about playing the DLC. No. No. It, we're never gonna play the DLC. I lied about Miles Morales too. I did I bought the copy recently just just so I can lie about it and not play Miles Morales. Yeah. Totally. We're never gonna see Miles we're never gonna see me play Miles Morales even though I kept talking about it the whole fucking series. Yeah. Nah, I lied to you. You've been goofed. You've been you've been memed. I lied. I'm a liar. That's what I do. I'm kidding. Uh, but yes, yeah, so no, that was Marvel. Mar that was the main story of Marvel Spider-Man. I'm not going to talk too much into it because we still have technically a good amount of the story left. I don't necessarily know how long um, each of the DLCs are. I, I think they might be broken up into two or three streams at most, and then. Right after Miles Morales will get its own series. I'm not just going to call it Marvel Spider-Man parts. Like like on YouTube, it, I'll probably put it into parts. But after this, it's just going to be its own thing and stuff. Each of those next parts are going to be its own series, technically. So I think the next part is just going to be DLC Part 1 or something. Because it's, it's all one continuous story, so... That I know. I don't really know much about. I'll, all I know is the first part has Black Cat in it. That's literally it. And then Miles Morales is the last part of the story until Spider-Man 2, whenever that comes out. <sighs> but man, it really... This series went by kind of quick, honestly. <laughs> like, technically, this is part 9, I guess. It feels like we did, like, a good amount of the percentages on camera for each of the parts and stuff, like 10% for each stream, which is a lot, to speaking of which. But, I don't know, it, it feels like, maybe could, we're technically, like I said earlier, we're not technically done with the game. We're done with the sto this story, of course, this story's done. But we still have like more content to go through and stuff and i did promise that it's not gonna be this stream i'm gonna like i said i'm gonna take a week between this and the next stream the next spider-man stream which is gonna be in uh what's today the 20th so on the 27th i will be playing another str another stream with spider-man until then i'm gonna be playing other games of course uh after after we get the there's, it's a Marvel game, of course, we're gonna get an end credit scene, so, um, I'm gonna, we'll show that, and then afterwards, we'll, um, I'm gonna try to fix the encoder, so, yeah, so that for our next room, it won't be dog shit. I'm not an expert or anything, but I think it's in the way that you ask it. I know, it makes you nervous. <laughs> hey, all right, so where do you want this? Uh, wherever it is, fine. Hey, so Pete. Yeah. I uh kind of gotta talk to you about something I can't tell my mom about. Oh, God damn it, he's gonna talk about puberty. Well, um, weird things have been going on. Like physically. I got hair on my balls, Pete. Oh. I need you to look. Uh. Well. Is that normal? You're at that age where where your your body starts to change, and so you may be noticing some areas, no. for example. Not that. Fucking oh, weirdo. Uh, I think it's, I think it's better that I just um, I show you. No, 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 no. It's pretty weird, right? It's not that weird. You're the human spider. Well, yeah, that was the end of uh, Marvel Spider-Man, folks. I'm gonna skip ahead. It's all right. Cause we're technically gonna get the actual credits after Miles. <gasps> Another end credits. What? What is this? He's going in the secret jacuzzi room. What's in there? Let's find out.
Ah, my secret jacuzzi. Well, let's spike. Look at that, folks. We unlocked the ultimate difficulty. I, I now have the power to change time of day. Cool. Can we get any suits? Let's see. And since we 100%ed the game, look, we unlocked this suit. The fuck is that thing called the Equalizer? What the fuck does the Equalizer do? Oh, yeah, this is a suit, by the way, we're going to be wearing in the DLC, so, yeah. It's gonna be fun. What does this do? Equalizer. Everybody goes, everybody goes, Jesus Christ! Fuck yeah! Any skills or anything I learned? Nah, I think that's it. Anti dock suit. Anti ox suit. I said dock. But yeah, no, we also got this one too, this anti dock suit. Yeah, cool. Let's go through our suits real quick before we say goodbye to this section of the stream. So we got started off with the advanced suit, which is what we got in the trailers. The original, the classic suit at the beginning, I kind of like it. I always like the design of this one. It's a classic spider suit. We got Stealth, the new R. Ben Riley's suit, the Scarlet Spider. Now we got the sort of... I, I always assume that this is just the second version of, of the anti-ox suit. We got Seeker Wars, we got the Stark suits, the negativity suits, the electric the electrically insulated suits, uh Rock Spider, uh Bone Saw McGee suit, Fear itself, not the symbiote suit, which kinda looks like it's certain if you use certain filters. Spider Armor Mark Three. Where is the Spider Armor Mark One? Probably see it later. Miguel O'Hara suits. Uh, the shitty suit I don't like. I actually don't like the iron, the MCU Iron Spider. I thought it was kind of whatever. Velocity suit. Spider Armor Mark IV. Uh, Death itself. The homemade suit. Last Stand. This suit I really do fucking love. Though. The vintage suit. I thought that shit was cool. Then we got the Spider Armor. The white suit, I mean. anti Ock. Dark suit. These are all DLC, so we're gonna get these later. The web suit. I wish it was just called the framey suit, but I don't take it over nothing. Mr. Bombastic. Upgrade Future Foundation. Night Monkey. The Amazing Spider-Man. Uh, I have no idea where this is from, but cool. I think it's supposed to be a common Rider suit. Armored Spider. I like it though, the armored look of the advanced suit and stuff. It's kinda cool. We got the hybrid suit, and then we got the magic and gold, black, the black, black and gold suit, which is just the magic suit. That was all our suits, ladies and gentlemen. So, uh, what we're going to be doing is, uh, I think we might play Twilight Princess today. Yeah. I'm going to take a little bit of a break. Probably start around 1040 or 1045 or something. Yeah, it's still probably the only late night Zelda stream we'll do, and then after that, I think we'll probably be done for the day. I might start early tomorrow, so just a heads up there. Alright, folks, uh, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in a bit. Adieu!